In a world of locally elected officials, one man leads the way. President Palmer. President Palmer. President Palmer. President Palmer. President Palmer. President Palmer. I proudly stand here today as President of the United States Conference of Mayors. Now, the next chapter begins. The Palmer Presidency, Part 2. The mayors taking care of business. He has tackled transportation problems head on. Now he has a 10-point plan to strengthen our communities. In order to have a strong America, you have to have strong cities. You have to have strong families. And build a bright future for our children. You're not too young to make good decisions about what you want to be in your life. Critics call the Palmer presidency. It's unbelievable. Tough, articulate. His shiny head leads the way. Mayors across the country are raving. I cried like a baby. Doug Palmer's probably a combination between Spider-Man and Batman. Thank God we have somebody that's really not funny. He comes to my city and blames me for the traffic. Doug who? And locally elected officials call Tom Cochran and Doug Palmer the most agile and mobile team since Mel Gibson and Danny Glover. There's something I haven't told you yet about President Palmer. He's a mayor so good, they cloned him. Enough is enough. Enough is enough! I have had it with these m snakes on this m plane! Another wonderful day in paradise. This summer, the mayor is on a mission to make our cities green. We're asking for $4 billion that will go to cities to help come up with best practices to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. To protect our climate for generations to come. 500 mayors have now signed our U.S. Mayor's Climate Protection Agreement. You mean Doug, the climate guy? And to ensure that no chip is left behind. No matter where you go, the potato chip. No chip, baby. No. And when the chips are down, always bet on ball. What's happening in this country and in our neighborhoods has got to be on the front burner of the next presidential election. And I guarantee you, the United States Conference of Mayors are going to weigh in on that. And the action has only just begun. The Palmer Presidency, Part 2. You know, Palmer is all right, but the next guy is a real winner.